First off, I want to give all praises to Yahweh in the name of his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai, in Paleo Hebrew. It's Kal, Halal, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rahach, Kodash. Double honors unto the elders and apostles of GMS who taught me just truth. Salutations to all the brothers out there that's teaching this word. The truth is sincerity and peace, blessings and healings unto the elect and the multitude, because that's why we do these videos. And uh, before I talk about what I'm going to talk about today, you know, last week I didn't make a video. And my computer was broke at the same time. I think Yahweh Shemeshah was giving me some rest, man, because I needed it. But I'm going to be back on my grind now. So um, today I'm going to talk about Elon Musk. Neutralink says it has FDA approval for human trials. You know, and then I got this article also because it coincides. Amazon Palm Reader Tech allows you to buy alcohol with just your hand with just your hand so it's gradualism okay they want you to get used to swiping your hand because they want to put that MOTB into your head into and into your hand as it says in Revelations 13 okay and then I got one of our people saying that right now y'all saying fuck that MOTB but eventually you're going to get it just like everything else you swore you would never do okay and I just want to say only the elect and the multitude is not going to take the MOTB they're not going to bow down to the wicked. Okay, and I'm going to get those scriptures. So, you know, let's start off with uh, playing this video. And then um, I'm going to talk about some stuff and get some scriptures. Elon Musk's brain implant company Neuralink said on Thursday it had been given a green light from the US FDA to kickstart its first in-human clinical study. It's a critical milestone for Neuralink after earlier struggles to gain approval. We're confident that it is possible to restore full body functionality. To on at least four occasions since 2019, Musk has said his medical device company would begin human trials for brain implant to treat severe conditions such as paralysis and blindness. Yet the company only sought Food and Drug Administration approval in early 2022, and the agency rejected the application, sources linked to the company told Reuters in March. The sources said the FDA had pointed out several concerns to Neuralink that needed to be addressed before sanctioning human trials. They include the device's battery, as well as safety issues surrounding its wires and the protection of brain tissue. Thursday's FDA approval comes as U.S. lawmakers are urging regulators to investigate the oversight of animal testing at Neuralink. The company has already been the subject of federal probes, including at least one linked to animal testing and treatment. In a tweet on Thursday, Neuralink said it was excited to share the news of the approval, but that it's not yet recruited for a clinical trial. Over the years, Musk has publicly outlined an ambitious plan for Neuralink. He envisions its devices to cure a range of conditions from obesity, autism, depression, schizophrenia, to enabling web browsing and even telepathy. And that both disabled and healthy individuals would be swiftly getting surgical implants at local centers. Neuralink and the FDA did not immediately respond to a Reuters request for comment. And uh, there you have it, man. You see how it talks about them healing blindness and healing all these, you know what I'm saying, affirmities that people got. You know, it says that they would do that in Revelations 13, man. Okay. Now, before I get the scriptures, let me just uh, read a little bit of this because this coincides with it. Um, it says fake IDs are about to get really messy. Amazon Palm Scanning Tech can now verify a person's age which can make it more attractive to bars and alcohol sellers. Per the information, Amazon One, the shopping's giant contactless payment identity service that's already available at several Whole Foods, Starbucks, and Amazon Go stores. So it's already being pushed out there, man. You know what I'm saying? And it's eventually going to come down to, you know, them making the MOTB mandatory, man. Okay, but they got to set up all these systems. You know what I'm saying? They got to crash a dollar. Make everything digital, okay? Everything's going to be on the blockchain. You know what I'm saying? This is just a part of it. You know, they all got the same plan. They're moving towards the same go. You know what I'm saying? So Amazon's a part of that. Elon Musk is a part of that. Now, let's go to Revelations because I'm going to get these scriptures. This is in Day's Prophecy right here, man. Okay, so going down to Revelations 13, and I'm going to read from 14, okay? And deceive of them that dwell on the earth by the means of those miracles you know healing the blind is a miracle healing the lame is a miracle okay so the devil's gonna be performing miracles out here with his technology okay but 
you don't want to take the head thing or the hand thing because if you do you're cut out from salvation you can't be saved anymore okay so Yahweh and Shai has set it up where you're going to overcome everything they do okay and then you're going to be given a reward it says which he had power to do in the sight of the beast so he deceived everybody with those miracles because he has the power right now okay Esau rules the world it says saying to them that dwell on the earth that they should make an image to the beast which had a wound by the sword and did live okay and here it goes right here let's go to go to this first okay little duval he's a comedian he says right now y'all say f that motb but eventually you're gonna get it just like everything else you swore you would never do now let's go read revelations 15 and he had power to give life unto the image of the beast that the image of the beast should both speak and cause that as many as would not worship the image of the beast should be killed okay so when they make this mandatory it's eventually going to come down to the elect and the multitude not going to take it okay and then they're they they're going to want to kill them man okay because there's people set up on the earth today that's not going to bow down to this and not going to take this thing this is romans 11 and 4 says but what saith the answer of god unto him i have reserved to myself even seven thousand men who have not bowed the knee to the image of Baal okay and this 7,000 is a whole lot of people man okay it's more than 7,000 that's just a complete number of people and it talks about who's not going to bow down okay the elect and the multitude okay the lamb and the 144 on Mount Zion in Revelation 14 man you know they're not going to bow down man point blank period they're not going to do it or you can go to Revelation 7 the 144,000 a multitude from the tribulation so these are the only people that's not going to uh take the motb man everybody else is going to take it man point blank period and they're going to want to kill us for not wanting to take it okay that's what it's going to come down to because in revelations 20 it talks about some of the elect getting beheaded okay so some people going to die for not taking it man but you just got to take that you know what i'm saying going back to revelations 13 now right here 16 and he calls a fall both small and great rich and poor free and bond to receive a mark in their right hand or in their forehead and this mark is a physical mark okay this ain't talking about sin okay let's go to the word mark okay um karagma okay karagma of a mark stamped on the forehead or the hand as the badge of the followers of the antichrist an imprinted mark okay so they got to carve that thing into you man if you can look up online how they put the microchip into your hand now go right here go to buzzfeed always get this video okay i put a payment chip in my hand to replace my wallet okay right here you can look up these videos but going back and that no man might buy or sell okay and that's why i got this article so if you don't have the karagma okay in your head or in your hand which elon musk was working on the head i already got one on your hand right here you know what i'm saying but amazon palm man <laughs> buying alcohol with a swipe of your hand so going back to revelations 13 you won't be able to what and that no man might buy or sell say if he that had the mark of the name of the beast or the number of his name and just to get another scripture on that this uh this is not sin this is a physical mark you can go to revelation 16 okay and it says and the first went and poured out his vow upon the earth and there fell a noisome and grievous sore upon the men which had the MOTB and upon them which worship his image. So you get a grievous sore, man. <laughs> like, come on, man. Look at this dude got a bandage on his hand. Okay. John the Revelator seen this, man. Through the spirit. He warned us, man. Some stupid people out here saying it's sin, man. You know. So amen you don't want to take this by any means necessary so let's go back to revelations 14 let's go down here for the doom for the worshipers of the beast and a third angel followed them saying with a loud voice if any man worship the beast in his image and receive his mark in his forehead or in his hand the same shall drink of the wine of wrath of god which is poured out without mixture into the cup of his indignation and he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels and in the presence of the lamb so if you want to die a horrible way 
in the presence of the lamb you want to die in front of your house shy looking down on you getting melted with a nuke then go ahead and take that thing man okay so going back to little duval man so he's going to take it man he already told you right here so he, he, he's through but the only people that's not going to take it is the 144,000 and the multitude man okay point blank period and you want to be a part of that number man the hopeful elect because they get the victory revelations 15 and 2 and i saw as it were a sea of glass mingled with fire and them that have gotten the victory over the beast and over his image and over his mark and over the number of his name stand on a sea of glass having the harps of god so you want to be saved man and you want to overcome the wicked one man okay that's why we on this earth to overcome trials man this is a uh, first john 2 and 14 i have written unto you fathers because you have known him that is from the beginning i have written unto you young men because you are strong and the word of god abideth in you and you have overcome the wicked one <laughs> okay so this is what we want to do even if we got to die man okay even if you got to take that death you take it man because the dead in your house arise first okay we're going to overcome death in the end man who cares about that okay point blank period so that's all i want to talk about today just some updates on the motb i'm about to be back on my daily schedule i'm back at it so double honors unto the elders and apostles of gms who taught me this truth and call her lawyer